Okay, 2 o'clock on what has been a very drippy Wednesday. Um, more rain than I thought we would get today, although it's interesting to note that the forecast models were showing upwards of a half of an inch of rain. Now, we did have that much. In fact, six-tenths last time I checked over at Astoria, Long Beach, uh, Pacific City, I think had some pretty good rainfall today. Last time I looked, Kelso Longview had uh, upwards of about two-tenths of an inch of rain, but generally it's been less than a tenth of an inch across the Portland metro area, and we're on the back side of it now, so I still think confidence is pretty high that by dinner time tonight it will be cloudy but dry, at least for the metro valley. Okay, uh, Thursday, the only question is fog in the morning. Do we have it? It looks like we probably will. How long does it last? If we clear out of the cloud cover by late morning out of the fog and have uh, decent sunshine, we could get close to 80 on Thursday. So just like that, back to some really nice weather. That cold front's still on track for Saturday. Right now it looks like we get cloudiness ahead of that on Friday. We may or may not see some rain here in the valley. Probably there will be some Friday rain at the coast. So high school football games could be some showers, but, but also very possible that, that we're dry. Uh, Saturday, forecast models uh, all seem to agree that they're really shifting the heaviest rain up to our north. So likely that we have some rain on Saturday, but maybe it's not that wet of a day. And maybe we only have a tenth of an inch... 15100 something like that and if you're going down to Eugene maybe there's barely anything if you're going down to the Ducks Washington State game Sunday still looks to be an in-between day there's a chance for showers but this could easily be dry in 70 then Monday the SNCC system the bulk of it is north so again right now it looks like a good chance we'll get some rain but maybe not much that's still kind of a question mark and then that front on Monday now looks like it could drape over our area on Tuesday. If that's the case, we would continue to see clouds, the ongoing chance of sun rain in the area, and cooler highs in the 60s after that, warming up, it looks like, on Wednesday. Okay, that's your seven-day update. I hope you're having a great day today. Um, any rain is great, right? And I will talk to you soon.